Morning everybody. It is currently 6.43 a.m. and we're going to the bins for a little bit because I have a doctor's appointment. We're just gonna go there until that, which is I think it's at noon. So we're only gonna be there a few hours. Hopefully we can hit it after, but I don't imagine I'll be able to hit bins long. So this will probably be a short little vlog, but uh, might as well make it anyways. Plus I gotta shout out this giveaway we're doing. All right, y'all, so we are back at Goodwill. It's like 1 p.m. I didn't show you anything from earlier because I wasn't here that long. So I left at like 11, 11.30. We only hit two fresh bins when I came out. Um, we got some decent stuff. I'll show you when I come back because I'm going to go and see if there's new bins out and check them out. Uh, but I'll show you like the stuff I got this morning, just a few decent items. I think it was like six or seven pounds worth. It's like 2.30. And the last bin is what we got. It's Harley Racing, the Made in USA Holovec tag. Uh, so just Harley Racing with the Screaming Eagle on the back. Uh, this old vintage Champion Reverse Wave Northern Iowa. Good tag there. 90s Taz, Big Head, for the Loon tag. And then this Hillfigure Athletics with the reflective accents. And both sleeves. And then on the first bin when I came in uh, back from the appointment, got this old Nautica Polo Rugby. Super good colorway. Uh, this was on a giant tag, you can see it. Um, but it's this Judy Bats. I won't pick it up because there's not good comps on it, but it's there anyways. And this dope 98. Pretty sure it's bootleg Harley Davidson. He's talking about the Road King Classic Acapulco. And on the front, it's got that chest hit. Not authentic, but it's cool. Now I'm just gonna show you. I forgot, I got. I just got this. Found out the bottom of a bin. It's in bad shape, um, bent, but it can be restored. And it's got the Goodyear patch, the mesh, and swingster. These, so I'll probably get like 20 to 30, probably 20, because the shape that it's in. So this is what I got earlier today. 1996 Bart Simpson Corduroy Snapback. Pretty fire. This is like 96 right there, my groaning. Sorry, my fingernails are fucking dirty because these bins are nasty and I didn't cut them this morning, but we'll do that tonight. Uh, this right here is just a simple little polo piece. See the little low tag right there and then the old polo. Uh, and then right here we got some like True Religion uh you know nothing cool but you know makes money and then this was actually a heater so this was actually a good one from this morning look at all the zippers the fleece the zippable zippable the hood that zips this is a brand you should be looking out for cool uh this is like 60 to 80 bucks doesn't look too crazy it's just a fleece but it's like 60 80 bucks that was good I've sold one of these before for I think 30 or 40. Uh, it's got the re reflective logo of the Navy on the MJ Safi tag. And the back's got the Navy with the reflective. And can't go wrong with the old Nike Essential Crew Neck. Nice little tag right there. That's all it for today. I'm about to eat, charge my phone, wait for these bins. I'm going to be spying on them. Appreciate you guys uh, being with me. We're not done yet. We're going to find some fucking grails. So uh, I'm just going to charge my phone, eat, go back in, and get something crazy for y'all. Y'all, look at this. I made this chicken myself. This shit slap, man. Mm! Let's get it. So we just finished the last bin. Here's some cool stuff we got. This Pearl Snap uh, 70s, I guess. Really cool. Uh, found this in an old bin, the polo with the three horse pullover. This 1987 World Series Twins Champions sweatshirt. This dope you and I and a Dodger tag. Cool look graphic. And then this was from the last bin. We just hit polo sport, spell out shirt, size small or whatever. This one's an all over print, Carl Edwards. Double sided. An old Wrangler, it looks like the flags it's just got the stripes, color blocking. Pretty cool. We got this uh, TNF Denali fleece. And then finally, the good old 
old rock mount ranch wear with the fold over bib. So how we're gonna do this is I'm gonna make an Instagram post right before I drop the video. And I'm basically gonna say like, like this post, What you don't even gotta like the post. Uh, just tag three friends and make sure that they subscribe to the YouTube channel. So if you just tag three people and they all subscribe, uh, at the end of the giveaway, I'm gonna give it like five days or uh, whatever, 24 hours, whatever. Uh, I'll let you know on an Instagram post but I'm gonna go through and if I randomly select you from uh, you know, Instagram, I'm just gonna go up and down on the comments and I'm just gonna hit a name. And if I pick you, I'm gonna go and make sure that the three people that is tagged or the person that commented and tagged the people, um, make sure they're actually subscribed to the channel. And if they're not, I'm just gonna redo it. Um, just trying to do something a little fun, a little different. I know most people do weird kind of Instagram giveaways, but I'm trying to incorporate YouTube more into this because uh, it's eventually what I want to do full time. I like YouTube way more than Instagram. So yeah, so I hope this goes good. First time doing a giveaway. If you guys have any tips for me on how to do it better, I'll put that into my, into my, my head. So uh, thank you guys so much.